<sighs> Hello again. Welcome back to another exciting installment of the Mass Effect trilogy. Technically, no shots fired. Insanity run. I'm Matt from Ascension Props. How's everybody doing today? Woo! <laughs> So, yeah, I wasn't planning on streaming this weekend, but wifey's letting me because she's playing her own game, which is totally fun. So we are here. When last we left our intrepid party, we did a whole bunch of stuff. We got Garrus back. We got Javik. We got a whole bunch of things started up. We had the Citadel going. So much awesomeness. Let's do a couple of quick announcements on my feeds. Oh, hi, Bug. How are you? You didn't sleep at all. You want to sit on my lap and play the game with me? Well, you can sit on my lap and play with me. Okay. Today we have a special guest. Ah. We'll play the game together. How's that sound? Go ahead. Hey, let's start playing. Let's see if we have any emails. Nope, no new emails. Room. The sound bar is off. No, it's not. It's not off. Can you not hear it? Grab me the remote then. <laughs> hurry, hurry, hurry. Ready? Yeah. You hear it now? There you go. Yeah, I've got it in my headphones so I can hear it just fine. Okay. Got fuel. I saw a big sun. Huh? I saw a big sun. You saw a big sun? Uh-huh. Isn't that cool? Uh-huh. I saw a nice little tree. Nice students. Meet with diplomats. Meet all these people. Let's see what's here. Let's see if I can do anything over here today. Nope. Signal confirmed. Ooh. See that? Stuff. Oh, that's a what's that? Ooh, what's that? That's a planet. Priority moon planet? Yay, we got money! And we got fuel, which we didn't need. Yeah, that, that looks like junk. <laughs> Space junk, huh? Uh-huh. Shrike Abyssal! I already talked to Joe. I already talked to Joe. I did that last time. Money. <laughs> Never have enough money. So 
Uh oh, Reapers are coming. Think they're gonna get me? No, let's go to a different spot. Ah! No! We made it. Uh oh. Oh, there it is. That's all I needed. Yeah. Let's see what's here. Probably more fuel. Yep, more fuel. Space junk again. Space junk again. <laughs> Yay, we made it. Nothing got ya. Nope. Let's see what's over here. This is a different place. Scan. Oh, that's a planet. Another. Yeah. We got the obelisk. And there's also spikes. Uh oh. Here they come. Uh oh. You think they're gonna get me? No. Yes. Uh -oh. oh. Space junk. Space junk. Yep. Reapers eluded. Whee. I don't like space junk. You don't like space junk? Why not? Cause, cause I keep seeing it. That space junk keeps giving me fuel. You don't need fuel? Successful. I do need fuel. Evasion successful. You're silly. Always nothing gets you. Always nothing gets me? It's because I'm awesome, huh? Yeah. Let's see. <laughs> That's me. Let's fly back here. Yep, that is you over there. <laughs> You're silly. Exit. I'm gonna take a look at what our options are. Grissom Academy, Dr. Bryson, Sir Kesh, stop it. Talk with the Krogan, okay. and Banner of the First Regiment. Someone on the Citadel who can use it. Maybe we should check the Citadel, see if we can actually go down there now. Eden Prime. I think I got all that it'll let me get, which is kind of sad. <laughs> okay, James, if you're just going to play, then you can go back to your room. Well, we got the Prothean Obelisks. Yeah, might as well bring it to him. Oh, I have four squad points. Oh, yeah, that's right. I'm saving them. Let's go to the Citadel. Yep. <laughs> you always take it. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's the thing that kind of You're cleared to dock, Normandy. Do you need ground mm, transport? Embassies. I need to get to the embassies. <laughs> yes, Commander. <coughs> Commander Shepard, Commander, the people of the Alliance are listening. That would be a no. Uh, hey, diplomat. I think I recovered the obelisk you mentioned from the Shrike Abyssal. It's waiting in bay D24. <laughs> Thank you, Earth Clan. You're welcome. <laughs> Thank you, sir. Yes, I have spoken to you. Why do you? I fully understand the situation. 
Of course. Please. Someone in your family is MIA? My son Bilal. And bureaucratic compassion seems to be in short supply. Yes, well. Bah. I'm Ambassador Dominic Osoba. My son's squad returned from their mission on Benning without him. I found them drinking, but they won't even look me in the eye. I can offer a bounty for any information. If Balao's alive, we want him home. If he's you can dead, let the dog out. Okay. The controller now. If I find anything. Thank you. Ow! Either way, you will set my mind at ease. Commander Shepard. Commander, the people of the Alliance. I'll talk to you in a minute. Still can't do the Turian. See if I missed anything on Palavin. Hey, bug. Daniels and Donnelly, I will absolutely pardon them. Haha, <laughs> I didn't miss anything on Palavin. Mm. Love you too, little guy. Commander Shepard. John Dumbau, Special Tactics and Recon. I've got intel suggesting that high-level Hanar officials may be indoctrinated. That's a damning accusation. What have you got? Evidence of an Alliance Black Ops team raiding a Batarian research station. The Batarians were studying Reaper technology. No mm -hmm. The Batarians had Reaper technology? The Alliance raid turned into a massacre, and the humans ended up with nothing. Because that's no, his armor. To hide the, incident. Oh. the Batarians would have gone to war if they'd found out. But how does this implicate the Hanar? They maintained discreet gray market trade relationships with the Batarians and led the Alliance to the station. We suspect those Hanar operatives escaped with Batarian tech. If your reports on the Reapers are accurate, they could already be indoctrinated. Yeah, What's your source on all this? It was an anonymous gift, but I believe it came from a thief named Kasumi Goto. I've been after her for years. <laughs> Kasumi? You're hunting a thief? Yep. Her intelligence and skill are almost Solarian. I'm sure she'd appreciate praise from the Spectre who's chasing her down. I only need her data. I admire her personally. And since she sent me this, I assume her feelings are mutual. Yeah, well. What do you need me to do? The Hanar operative is now a diplomat on the Citadel. I don't have a public name, and the Hanar will go to ground if I make a formal inquiry. So we're hunting? I'm tracking suspicious transmissions to the Hanar homeworld. I could use your help. Let me see what I can dig up at the Spectre office. Thanks, Shepard. And for the record, not everyone doubted your concerns about the Reapers. I just hope we're not too late. <laughs> huh? So, remember when you helped me get KG's gray box from Donovan Hawk? The one with information that could start a war? Information like an Alliance Black Ops raid on a Batarian research lab? Yeah, well... I figured it wouldn't hurt to leak it now. Especially if there really is an indoctrinated jellyfish out there. Crazier than usual. Because she's a thief, she has to hide. Maybe I can help you dig up some dirt on the hand. I appreciate it. I wish I was trying to work for you. Let's go in here, see if there's anything we need to learn. And our embassy tracking. Enable. Shepard, I'm checking security reports. Can you track the transfers coming from the Hanar embassy? On. On it. Hanar are predictable. Anything suspicious in their terminal use should narrow down our list of suspects. So you approve of Bao? Absolutely. He's a good specter. The galaxy needs more like him. <laughs> and the fact that he's trying to arrest you? Well, eh. Heheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheh
tried to kill you. Eh, nobody's perfect. <laughs> Commander Shepard. Val, I have some possible hits. Got some strange money transfers on Balone, and Alun is sending a lot of data. Balone's clean. His money transfers are to support his mistress. Not sure about Alun. I'll pull his bio. I'll check Alun's personal records and pull his recent messages. Can I just note how odd it is for mm -hmm. Hanar to have a mistress? You know, if Val catches up with you. Younger, you mean me. If I join up, last time I did that, you wrote me into a suicide mission. I didn't say you had to join up. <laughs> Let the dog back in. Okay. Where the uh, Ravine and Thane, Arya, Officer and James, they are Edie and Joker. Yay! I can go everywhere. Okay. You're in the way, James. Little taxis. Oh, wa a water fountain. Now we're yeah. at Docking Bay E24. Emergency. Well, Balloon's yeah. doing some heavy rock. Why does it so fade out? Who's opposing him? An unnamed Hanar recently posted here from Kajay. I'll check transit records for incoming Hanar. It all comes down to the war, and you trying to pull everyone into it. Would you rather the Reapers win? I'd rather spend whatever. KG wouldn't want you to spend all your time plugged into that. Well, he shouldn't have died then. Let them land. I'll pay. This isn't about money. The wards are already at capacity for refugees. There's just no room. You let Asari in here earlier. That's back when we had space. Where is my family supposed to go? Sure you can't squeeze in a few more people, officer. And who the heck are you? Oh, Commander Shepard. Uh, if that's <laughs> what you think, I'll, uh... I'll find them somewhere. And so find whatever room you can. Commander Shepard says your family's serious. Mm. Just tell them James, don't do that, okay? Not one. Yeah. Excuse me. Very distracting. Sit up a bit. Terrian State Arms. Terminus! I'll buy the rest of the stuff later. You're not dead, he's hurt. I recovered your pillars of strength from the kite's nest. They're yours, waiting in Bay D24. Yay! Yeah. Yeah, they do. Nothing to buy over there. I 
something to do over here yet. Let's check on those Metagel supplies. Yes, sir. And have we heard anything from the hospital? The surgeons there are all busy. Keep on it. Some of these wounded don't have much time. You go, Gareth. Shepard. What's happening? We convinced the council to accept our wounded. Nowhere else to go. <clears throat> How bad is it? Sorry. More dead than injured. 85% killed in action. Oh. We'll need a morgue soon. Is Not a lot of flesh wounds when you're fighting rapers. Casualties are that high? Mm -hmm. Our frontline units are being wiped out, whole platoons at a time. A single reaper can destroy nine or ten of them in one attack. That's platoons. It's slaughter. They're called reapers for a reason. And these guys found out why. Do what you can for them. A few of them might get back on their feet, but the rest... Sympathy is about all we can offer. Any sign of your family? Not yet, but I keep hoping. What about you? I'm starting to see some wear and tear. Oh Been better. <laughs> it's been rough. Well, don't forget to come up for air. Yeah, a lot more war to go. You have a copy of a Shepherd VI. Oh yeah, the one based on that war hero. We locked it after some kid spilled soda over the hardware. I'll unlock it, but we've only got the demo version working. <laughs> Good to meet you. I'm Commander Shepard, Alliance Navy. Doesn't even sound like me. We just got a report that another ship made it off Palo. How many on board? That's all. What? This is going to be hard. A lot. Like a whole lot. I've got a list of new Hanar arrivals, Val. Forwarding it to you. Damn. These are all like face names. Six? The Hanar names from the Alliance raid are soul names. Like thousands. And Hanar soul names are private. Do a no thousand? Millions. Thousands, millions. On it. Maybe we'll find names there. So how's the rest of the game? That's too else. many! Garrett Watch the show. In Normandy. He never could pass up a good fight. Haven't heard from him. See, Jacob could have gotten me back onto the Normandy. I thought you were happy with your memories of KG. Hey, <laughs> I'm nostalgic, not dead. Val, here's the correspondence. If there's any mention of soul names. I've got it. A recent arrival. Zemendis. Soul name regards the works of the Enkindlers in despair. He was with the Alliance team that matters the Batarians. He's been on special research assignment ever since. <laughs> So, he got his tentacles on some reaper tech. Looks that way. I'm sending you the nav point for his office. Welcome, meet you there. Commander Shepard. Please, Select. one moment, please. Back up here we go. Yep. Lots more ships. Save. Hello. Zemandis. Or should I say, regards the works of the Enkindlers in despair? It seems this one has been apprehended, but confinement is irrelevant. <laughs> the work of the Enkindlers cannot be stopped. Why are you trying to help the Reapers? Because... We obtained information regarding the Enkindlers from classified sources. The Enkindlers? You mean the Protheans? Yes. As you are aware, Commander Shepard, the Protheans eventually became the Collectors, and the Collectors served the Reapers. Well, you've got to be kidding me. <laughs> this is what happens with Zealotism. of the Enkindlers... We too must serve the Reapers. You big stupid jellyfish. <laughs> I think all religious freedom for all species. But that's uh -huh. just crazy. Your skepticism does not matter. When the Enkindlers uplift us as their chosen sapients, the galaxy will bear witness. <laughs> You're insane, and we can't allow you to endanger your planet. We are taking you into custody. 
Your belief in your victory is mistaken. Our planetary defense network is largely automated. It can be disabled with a single virus. Which I have just uploaded. Damn it. Wait. A virus would be detected unless sent on low priority channels, which have a time lag. I may be able to block the upload. You may be delayed. Help him. I'll handle this. Punch. Dead. Got it. Uploads disabled. Looks like we're in the... Wait. He's got some kind of failsafe. Get down! Oh. She was here the entire time. Yes, sir. She was an old friend. I intended to arrest her. She helped me take down the collectors, and she just gave her life to save the Hanar homeworld. Point taken. It was an honor <laughs> to work with you, Shepard. When the time comes, I'll be there to return the favor with a few friends. Thank you. <laughs> you can get up now. You can come out now. How'd you know? <laughs> Lucky guess. Nope. There's no way you're recruiting me to fight in a galactic war. The Crucible Project needs technical experts. I'm not a scientist. No, but you're the best thief in the galaxy. And you can hack unfamiliar technology better than anyone. They could use your help. And think of it. All that expensive tech just lying around. Oh, Shepard, you're not making me blush. pockets at the end of the project. You say the nicest things. <laughs> All right. I'm in. And Shep. Nice working with you again. Yeah, well. Woohoo! Commander Shepard. That was a big yawn. You okay? It was a big yawn. That was a big yawn. After Huerta, let's go to Huerta. Metagel formula. Figured you could make good use of it. Where did you find this? Never mind. It doesn't matter. Yes, we can put this to good use. Thank you. Yeah. <laughs> Commander Shepard. Thing, thing, thing. When I heard Earth was under attack, I tried to call. I never got through. Thing. Good to see you staying in shape. <laughs> My disease kills slowly. With enough care and a healthy lifestyle, it can be delayed for a few years. Of but... course, it's a lot of time has come and gone. Now I exercise because it pleases me. What are you doing here? Visiting a friend, Caden. He got hurt protecting me. <laughs> the human biotic and in intensive care. I saw the marks of an implant. Yeah. We have spoken. He seems an honorable sort. Your enemies may try to finish him off here. I will look out for him. I appreciate it, Thane. I am near the end of my life. It is a good time to be generous. <laughs> Keppel Syndrome has put most of my other plans on hold. Yeah, well... I'm back on the Normandy on this. I would not be, Isla. And if I know you, you will want to fight the Reapers somehow. <laughs> you need the best at your side. And I am not at mine. <clears throat> you don't have to wrestle down Krogan and break their necks. I'm sure we could find you lighter work. I am at peace with what I've done in my life, Shepard. There comes a time when one must rest from war and conflict. As Shepard goes. Your time. Uh, that would be nice, wouldn't it? Do you know how much time you have left? I've been to several doctors. 
My favorite gave me three months to live. Nine months ago. <laughs> it's freeing to find no requirements placed on me. No responsibilities. No fears. It is a good end to a life. Are you in a lot of pain? At times. As a result, my blood. As for my brain, I cannot track the damage. I just experience dizziness from time to time. And that's everything. I wish the best for you, Thane. And I for you. Do not grieve for me. I have good doctors. My son visits regularly. That's Perhaps good. Perhaps we will keep up via the extranet now that you are free. Until we meet again, Shepard. Till we meet. Remember his own name without the VI in his head telling him what it is. Trust me, in this building, we know dead. The Supreme <laughs> Court says he's alive. Five justices say he's alive, two of them appointed by him. The name is what it is. It's completely tasteless to call this place Puerto. Having a VI drive your body isn't life. Are Reaper husks alive? <laughs> you did not just say that. But it's the same thing, isn't it? He walks and makes noises just like they do. Fine. <laughs> I guess I'm just surrounded by zombies. Thanks. Took her long enough to get the hint. We were deployed to Tiptree. It's a small human <laughs> colony. We were supposed to help with evac. The enemy was landing. Just scouts, the Turian things, a few of the big ones. <laughs> we were spread over half the continent, getting colonists to shuttles, wiping out husks. It sounds like you were doing good work. Could I have a gun? I feel a lot better. Just tell me what happened at Tip Tree. We need these biotic upgrades to fight the Reapers. Yes. I want biotic upgrades. I'd like an answer, Major. The galaxy has need of exceptional soldiers like you. No more than ever. Get out of here. You'll have it soon, Counselor. I promise. I look forward to it. Shepard. What are you all pissed off at me for? Hey. Well, why aren't Shepherd, you, but... Hey, hey. You, you just missed snack time. Actually, that's probably a good thing. <laughs> Thanks for coming. No problem. What did Udina want? Still thinking about the Spectre position? That was a big honor. A huge responsibility. Just need to be sure. I got you this. Wow, thanks, Shepard. That's really great. Just a little <laughs> pick me up. Maybe when I'm out, we can crack it open and celebrate. I am so ready to get out of here, Shepard. You can't tell, but I'm tied to this bed by medical red tape. I'm a doctor. Doc says I'm good to go, but then she always finds just one more test to run. You doing okay? <laughs> My implant got bruised all the hell. Rattled. So Doc just wants me to keep the biotics offline for a bit. It's really no big deal. Mm. Need me to break you out? <laughs> I'll let you know.
I'm glad you asked me to come. Thanks. You almost died on my watch. I want you to be straight. So I just want to make sure, after Mars, after Horizon, you and me, we're good. We've been through hell together, at each other's backs. That kind of bond is hard to break. <laughs> no, not just that. You were my commander, sure, but you listen, too. We went through Asher's death together. Yeah. yeah. We did. So what do you say? <sighs> Are we good? We're good. It was great to have you back on the Normandy. Thanks. Feel like we've cleared the air? Yeah, you know, I'm... I'm not sure that I've been wrong about Cerberus, but... I've been wrong about you. I should let you get back to the Normandy. Wish I could come with you. Take care of yourself, Caden. We need you at 100%. Will do. Thanks for coming. Yeah, I floated on him, and he's got a funky shadow. <laughs> Doop -a -doo. Does this have anything else to sell? More mid gel capacity, absolutely. Thank you for shopping. Welcome, Commander Shepard. Please select the destination. Purgatory. Mm, who's this? Who's the baddest of me? Hi there! <laughs> Hello, Faya88. Glad to have you here. <laughs> hey, you ready to get this party started? Hey, now you're uh... Uh, here, and I'm halfway in the wall. I'll go yes, away. Yes, and it only took C-Sec three weeks to figure it out. I don't care who you are. You're required to go through processing like all other refugees. Come with me. I don't think so. Shear, <laughs> get me the Asari counselor. Greetings, Arya. Is there something you need? Yeah. I'm being asked to submit to immigration processing. Of course you are. Done. What else can I do for you? Nothing. Mm. Thank you. Go away. My pleasure. <laughs> I think we're done here. Enjoy the show, Shepard? I guess there's one rule on the Citadel, huh? <laughs> I guess so. I hate this place. So sickeningly up to Then why are you here? Cerberus stole Omega from me. The elusive man is now squarely at the top. 
I did Cerberus. Deceit, distraction, and a big fucking army. <laughs> they lured me away from Omega and ambushed me. I escaped, but Cerberus had already laid siege. By the time I could launch an assault, they were too entrenched. Well, you're alive. At least you escaped to fight another day. I'll take Omega back. I'm listening. The way I see it, if you don't do <clears throat> on Omega, I kept the blood pack, blue suns, and eclipse in check. Now they're running amok. Nobody wants that. Unite them under my rule, and you'll have a powerful and ruthless force for your war. I've laid the groundwork with all three groups. I just need you to close the deals. <sighs> yeah, well. If a gun, he'll shoot you in the back. They already have guns, Shepard. <laughs> I'll make sure they point them at the Reapers. Appreciated. I'm to help you. Why don't you think it over? Meet with Narl, my agent who's dealing with the Blood Pack. The Blue Sun's leader is incognito here on the Citadel. He'll be expecting you. And I already have a deal with Jonas Sedaris, the Eclipse leader. You just have to get your friend, Commander Bailey, to let her out of jail. <laughs> you obviously don't know Bailey very well. <laughs> Bailey respects you. Lean on him. I think a united force of professional mercs is worth it. Don't you? It's always a pleasure, Shepard. Let me know if you want to talk later. Oh, goodness. Have to do it. Where is it? Oh, no dance option up here. down here Damn it, you guys Commander Shepherd. here maybe I can help the banner of the first regiment is waiting for you at Bay D24 yes you do hello dancer hello James Hey, Commander. Nice to see you down here in the dirt with us grunts. Do you think I don't like getting dirty? Well, hold down. <laughs> Come on. I didn't mean anything by it, Uh-huh. What did you mean, then? See those Marines over there? None of them officers. Just soldiers fighting the war. Yep. Yeah? They've been buying me drinks all night. You know why? Same reason Eight. they got all quiet and serious when you walked in. You don't seem intimidated by me. Because you're big and tall and they don't want to be on your bad side. <laughs> sure, but I fought with you. I've seen you in action. Now, don't get me wrong, you're good. You're probably one of the best. Probably. <laughs> you fill out a uniform like nobody's business. Oh, shut it. Hey, but I know you're human. Just like me. But not them. Nope. nope. Hell, I still remember the day they made you the first human specter. I watched it on the vid. Put you on a pedestal. But to them, you're still larger than life. I've seen a hell of a lot, but I'm still just a soldier. You're still one of them. Sure, but they don't know you. They just know what they've been told. Yeah, Listen, well. You want them to see you're one of us, right? Maybe. Then buy them around. Mm, I do like that, but... Let's not overdo it. Well, you could at least buy me around. Yeah. I had a feeling you were working up to that. Yeah, and I have a feeling you're not going to buy me one. Nope. And I can't dance over here yet. Oh well. Aria. I want to go to the commons, but I can't yet. Well, actually, now I can. If you do, a lot of walking around so far. Not a lot of action, but I guess that's what happens when Welcome, Commander Shepherd. trying to get everywhere. 
and do all the little things that you can do. So don't. So you want us to enlist as soldiers? Isn't there anything else we can do? The military needs it. You two could save lives by helping mm -hmm. doctors in the refugee camps. No. Mm -hmm. uh, thanks. Who was that? Commander Shepard? Wow, Commander Shepard? Yeah, and it's good advice. Let's sign up as med tent volunteers. Well, that's much better than shooting myself in the foot. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, yeah, anything sounds better than shooting yourself in the foot with a rifle. Hello, Barlevon. Do Cerberus armor because why not? Barium VI. Even talks to the fish when you're not around, leaving you free to enjoy your aquatic friends without fear of killing them. <laughs> uh, <laughs> Speaking of fish, well, first there's this, and the blood dragon armor. Buy some boy. If you, you can, can help. help. Look, Cyrus, if you want to sell your shares of walk fine, but I'm not selling financial VIs while my home will burn. Okay, okay, let me think. We could repurpose the VIs for upgraded targeting solutions. That would be good. Right. We'd be able to use most of the hardware. The financial VI has more processing power than we need. No, no, that works. We'll rig the VI and it translates for all standard weapons. Refit weapons without having to overhaul your targeting computer. Rapid response flexibility. We'll make a fortune. A small fortune. We're selling cost plus three percent. Yeah, family driver duties. I totally understand. Enjoy. Be safe. It is winter after all. <laughs> Thanks for stopping by. Sorry I'm not very talkative apparently today. talking about Crete blood pack's leader Arya brings him the Greek commander Shepard Crete pledges the gang to her we're just luring him into the open so we can take him out okay Not the best start to our friendship Narl. he's coming put your hands behind your back oh nice Try to look like you're in Las Vegas yeah we just got a freak storm today 
So. <laughs> Need to make another trip to Vegas one of these I days. Look even more powerful than Crick thought. Her instructions on boarding Citadel undetected were one thing. Now this. <sighs> Commander Shepard wants you to know your head will be hood ornament on my personal shuttle. Keep your distance, Creed. So, do you agree to Arya's terms? It's gonna fire, force me to fire another shot, isn't it? Arya can use blood pack as she sees fit. Wasn't talking to you, Crete. Quill? What? You have my word. Now open fire! Oh, well, it was a cutscene, so I couldn't do anything. Those count. Looks like he took a shuttle to the face. I may be ambitious, but I'm not crazy. Good work, Narl. Thanks for the gun. Anytime, Shepard. Grill and I will let Arya know the light is green. Is the trap clean though? Ha ha. Ha ha ha. It's only going to get worse. She just starts screaming. I can even hear it when I'm trying to sleep now. I'm supposed to be helping her. But I feel like I'm breaking her world all over again every time she sees me. Uh, Any human would probably trigger that reaction for her at this point. No. I looked up the file on that colony she was at. That girl she keeps talking about? We look alike. Ouch. I shouldn't even be allowed in to help anyone. We must find a way to stabilize the heating unit so the water temperature can remain steady. The colony's location is hardly ideal for our species. The flood will be imperiled if we do not execute. I should have gone to Bailey first, because that's where I go for that portion. I'm afraid I can't help you. <laughs> but your manager said you could give me a refund if I made an appointment. You're not on my appointment list, and you don't have a receipt. I don't even think we carry that version anymore. Listen, I don't need a new model, store credits, or anything. I just want my money back. That's nice. Nothing Bring a receipt. A sales record of some kind. I can go get the warranty book from my car. Doesn't matter. I can't help you. But your manager said... Are you keeping this guy at work while there's a war on? Um, well, it's his job, right? Thank you, Bioware, for sticking us... I sticking up for us retail peoples. Hey, Lady Kilitha. Say hello to the human race. Don't need to buy anything there yet. I mean, I could start buying up all of this stuff, but I'm holding off until I've gotten all of the important things, and then I'll start getting the upgrades. Oh, I need to make this desperately. Citadel model. Yeah, I really need to do this. Ooh, 
Hello, Joker. Hey, Commander. Check it out. Big news. The Blasto movie is breaking opening week records. Woohoo! There's also a big expose on Quasar tournaments. Tips on how to make your apartment look bigger. And, oh, yeah, a big ass Reaper invasion. Humans must run the news, too. <laughs> These people have no idea. When big events shake up the galaxy, <coughs> they cling to what's familiar. Yep. You say that like it's a good thing. It's better than riots in the streets. I guess. <laughs> I just wish there were a middle ground. You know, a little less gardening advice, a little more war prep. It'll happen once there's something people can do to help. Meanwhile, they ignore the unshackled AI walking around the Presidium. She run into any trouble? No, no, she's my mobility assistance mech. <laughs> Thanks to Vrolic syndrome, I'm legally entitled to bring her everywhere. <laughs> Convenient that. Use out of those disability benefits. I'm sure she appreciates getting out to see the sights. Ah, she's earned a little shore leave. Yeah, well. Shepherd. Hello. You look like you're gathering data. Well, that is a safe assumption. <laughs> Anything big and world shaking? Man's inhumanity to man? Does objective reality really exist? That kind of thing? <laughs> I was running scenarios in my head to analyze Jeff's behavior. He likes you. I believe he has a strong affectionate attachment to me, but he has not stated it to anyone yet. Nope. When you are sexually interested in another, what kind of advances do you make? Uh, I haven't romanced anybody, so how would I know? Uh, you know, there are the uh, intimate talks, um, thoughtful gifts, joking around. Jeff does often try to lighten the mood with humor. That could indicate a 33.3 repeating percent chance that he cares for me. But that is insufficient data for determining his motives. Mm -hmm. Perhaps we could discuss how to provoke Jeff into an emotional commitment. <laughs> That's... Not how to think of it. It's got to be natural. You need chemistry. I see. There are a number of things that Jeff just simulate because I'm in a emotional state. No. No, I mean relax and do something you both like. Something simple. For example, you both like humor. Correct. Yeah. I will see if there are comedic entertainment shows being presented on the Citadel. Scanning. Do you think he would like the man who hung himself? It appears to be about an amorous plastic surgeon. <laughs> Edie, the important thing is to have a good time, wherever you go. And if you're having fun, he probably will too. Then the outcome is an unknown quantity. But you are saying I should attempt it anyway. Yep. Nobody ever fell in love without being a little bit brave. I see. I believe you have improved my chances, Shepard. Thank you. You like him too. Yeah, no inferno armor yet. That's okay. I don't usually use it anyway. Come up here. We've got to keep Jake in daycare. He should be socializing with other children. But what if there's another attack? We can't spend our I remember you guys. We're in the middle of a war. Listen. Do whatever is best for your family. Just do it soon. Things are bad out there. We will. And thank you. <laughs> Here's Liara. Still working? One call leads to another, and here I was hoping I'd have time to enjoy the view. The last time I saw the Presidium, remember how it was all rubble after Sovereign attacked? Uh, yeah. I, I was in that rubble. Presidium before half of it got crushed. And by the time they repaired it, it was time for the next invasion. <laughs> Citadel hasn't seen the reality of this war yet. We should stock up on necessities while we can. Yep. Ezo, heavy arms, mercenary groups. <laughs> we'll get the people. Take a moment for yourself now and then. I know, I know. 
but there's always just one more task or meeting. Speaking of Welcome which, to being to Bolas, Barlavan. He'll point you to some mercenaries willing to join us. <laughs> I was just up there. Hello. Commander Shepard. It's been some time. Yep. Barlavon, in case you've forgotten. Financial advisor. Mm -hmm. And an acquaintance of Admiral Anderson. I admire the courage it took for him to stay and fight on your home world. I remember you. He's an agent to the Shadow Broker. I still am. <laughs> the broker has been exceedingly busy lately. Yes, well... A team of his guards have become stranded in a Reaper-controlled territory. Rescue the guards, and they're yours. The Shadow Broker fully supports your efforts against the Reapers. Yeah. I appreciate the information. Just don't wait too long to act on it. The Reapers are advancing all too quickly. Come see me once you've completed the extraction. I'll be in my office a while longer. The For now. The market is in considerable flux. Yep. Everything's exploding. Imagine that. Let's see. Oh, and all that. That, all of that, Yara. We gotta go to the holding area. We've also got to talk to Bailey. Welcome, Commander Shepard. One moment. Let's go talk to. No, why did I? I'm an idiot. Embassies. Yay, loading screens. Now arriving at the Commander Shepard Embassy. Commander, people of the Alliance are coming. Shepard, to what do I owe the pleasure? Uh, stuff. I'm here to talk stuff. to you about releasing Jonas Adaris. Damn, you too? Somebody <laughs> got the council to order her release. I'm delaying as best I can. What's your stake in this? It's classified. <laughs> <laughs> That's a fancy way of saying mind your own business. <laughs> Generally. There's no way I'm letting that psychopath out. The woman's unstable and a clear public threat. What makes you think she's crazy? A lot. She was a ruthless sadist before she got caught. Her imprisonment has cracked a shell off the nut. Maybe freedom will improve her. She no. She changes day and night, Shepard, calling for the deaths of all Eclipse enemies. No, freedom will only give her the chance to kill. I'd like access to her to judge for myself. <laughs> sure thing. I'm sure you'll agree. Then maybe the Council will listen to you and rescind the order. Go to the C-Sec outpost. My assistants will connect to Sedera's cell from there. Then call me back. Okay. I honestly love this whole process. She sends me to go do a whole bunch of freeing and helping and blah blah blah. And I turn around and get a whole new set of leadership for all of the people. <laughs> Commons. Now arriving at Presidium Commons. 
Have you decided how to tell him? I don't know. A text message? So stop it. Doopy doo. Oops. Gotta go the right way. Hello. Real quick. We haven't done it in a while. I'm Jonas Sedaris and her cell commander. You can speak with her via that console. Okay. Thanks. We'll need some privacy. Of course. When you're done, you can also contact Commander Bailey from that terminal. <laughs> the servant has finally come to deliver me to freedom. I want to no. talk with you before I secure your release. Bullshit. You have no choice. And when I get out, heads will roll. Oh, oh, oh yes. <laughs> You've killed a lot of my people. Don't think I've forgotten that. You have to move on. Mm -hmm. And I will. No. I have all the power. No, you don't. Is that right? <laughs> yes. Saying my second in command is a weak willed toady. If he had balls, he'd leave me to run and take control himself. But he won't defy me. He knows better. Now get me out of here, Shepard. Tell Bailey to release me. Bailey, I've seen Sedaris. <laughs> so she's crazy, right? It would be ridiculous to let her out. Yeah. She's a menace. Let me try to make this problem go away. Yes, sir. Hold the line. You don't think sanctuary is real? Do -do -do. Running, 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 running. Where do I need to go? Ah, yes, the holding area. Welcome, Commander Shepard. One moment, please. I wonder if we'll see a certain someone, too. Now arriving at Docking Bay E24. E24. What about the food we were promised? It's been allocated to the recipient. Then contact Commander Bailey over at CSEC. Tell him Garrus Vicarian would consider it a personal favor if he could reallocate the shipment so these people don't starve. <laughs> Men, Good job, Garrus. Get ready for trouble. I've got Garrus next to me. Not here, I'm fine. Insane. Just want to talk about Jonas Sedaris's release. Oh, you're the one coordinating that, right? My sort idea. of. Arya came to me looking to gain Eclipse support. I'm leveraging it to bust the boss out. Saying you should run Eclipse. <laughs> Wait, what? <laughs> Leave Sedaris locked up and make the deal with Arya yourself. Hmm. Arya would be a step up. And you think she'd let me run things? I don't see why not. Right. <laughs> right. Then that's the plan. Keep Sedaris in jail. I'll call Arya right away. Sure. Good man. <laughs> wow. Arya wasn't kidding. The great commander Shepard on a leash. Smack. I'm here for my own reasons, Bosk. Oh, sure you are. Anyway, tell her I'm impressed, but to do business, I still need my little problem taken care of. Which is? 
The Torian general named Oraka has it out for the Blue Suns. He's raising a stink over our activity in this sector. <laughs> I'll commit my gang to Arya as soon as Oraka's dead. There must be more to Oraka's complaint. We're just making little raids along trading routes. With Arya's blessing, I might add. Uh -huh. Oraka's just some military fossil who came out of retirement to relive the glory days and justify his existence. Losing him won't affect your war in the least, but gaining the Blue Suns, well, you know our... You seriously think I'll assassinate a Turian? Arya seems to think so. She knew the price. The two of you work it out. <laughs> oh, and, uh... <laughs> tell Arya I still expect her blue ass in bed with me. Yeah, no. What is it, Shepard? You knew about this? Can you be more specific? <laughs> Darner Vosk expects me to kill General Oraka. Who cares what Vosk wants? What he needs. Her hands doing Darner something funky. To stop disrupting his operations. I figured you'd talk to Oraka, see if you can get him to lay off. And if he won't listen to reason, call me, and I'll take care of it. I don't see the distinction. And the still distinction doing funny things. The chance to save his life. Right. Why didn't you just tell me this yourself? Because you needed to realize who he's dealing with. Plus, if I have to suffer that scumbag staring at my tits one more time, I might have to kill him. Yeah, he mentioned that uh that I'm going to sleep with him. We all have our delusions. And up here again. And back and forth. Okay, Araka is at the commons again. Back and forth I go. Say that again. <laughs> You're welcome. Welcome, Commander Shepard. Please select a destination. One moment, please. It's what I do, Bailey. It's what I do. Is in area four. I guess it doesn't matter how I do it. I just need to tell them about this. Commander Shepard. Hello. General Araka. I think we met in Cora's den. You were pretty miserable, if I recall. A little bit. Yes. Neck deep in drink just before I retired. I'm clean now. Reinstated. That's good to hear. May I? I hear you're taking on the Blue Suns. I need to do my part for the Citadel, Commander. The Blue Suns are raiding CSEC weapons shipments. I'm putting a stop to that. Those mercs are seriously jeopardizing the Citadel's ability to defend itself if the war comes here. When the war comes here. There are other ways to secure weapons, General. You don't think I've tried? There's a black market dealer on Citadel right now, but he won't sell his top-line arms. The Reapers are destroying everything in their path, <laughs> and I can't stop them. But I can stop the Blue Suns. Uh, let me do my magic. Let me see what I can do for you. I'd appreciate your help, and I'll have a plan of action ready if things fall through. Black market number six. Yeah, I'm gonna do my thing. And you're behind. Look, Commander, I don't want any trouble. I'm authorized to sell here, and all my arms are legal. See? Uh huh. 
These are lightweight weapons. Where's your top end inventory? Shit, you slumming for C-Sec too? I already got harassed by the old Turian with a bad attitude. Yeah, I got much better stuff, but it's off the market. Galaxy's going belly up. Credit won't mean anything once the Reapers rip through. So what exactly are you saying? <laughs> Never happens. I figure there'll be survivors, but it'll be chaos. I'm betting things will run on a barter system. Yeah, well. So I'm getting a jump. My best stuff only trades for hard goods and artifacts with real value. So what gets me access to your top shelf? Heh, <laughs> Turian just waved credits in my face and spat on it. Nice to see you have flexibility. <laughs> if you find any rare pieces when you're out saving the galaxy, bring them back. Then I'm happy to share my top stock with C-Sec, no problem. Outside of that, I gotta stick to my guns. Credits don't talk with me, Commander. C-Sec wants my top of the line. You gotta come through with a couple artifacts. Welcome to Super Teen Armory. We appreciate your visit. Let's see, he wants... He wants a bunch of stuff. Run back over his direction. <laughs> Commander, unless you can find a new source of weapons for CSEC, I'll get you your weapons. I appreciate the effort, but I've spent. Well, you're gonna have to, so. <laughs> Can't sit on my hands for too much longer. Oy, oy, oy. Have I done everything there is to do here so far? Just need those two. Oh, yep. Welcome, Commander Shepard. One moment, please. <laughs> yep, back to the Normandy. Now that we have a billion side quests. <laughs> Thankfully, unlike two, there isn't the clock. That's nice. Back to Kite's Nest. So this is why we do the 100% of these ones, because you see when something changes. Get artifacts. So convenient.
There it is. Reapers eluded. Faster than light jump successful. If you'll notice. Every time I exit, I return in the opposite side that I left. So if I go out this way, I come in on that side. Go out this way, I come out on this side. It's very convenient for avoiding the Reapers. Little tip there. <laughs> Okay, so that's back up to 100%. That's still 100%. 100, 100. Ismar Frontier, Minos Wasteland. Ismar Frontier, I should say that properly. I don't think there's anything to do here. Come to think of it. We've been here before. Let's go back out. Ugh. Stuff. Whole bunch of things to pick up. And not a lot of places opened up yet. In fact, let's just do that now. Go into here. This is where Grissom Academy is. And there's nothing to collect either, apparently. We'll come back when I'm a little bit stronger. <coughs> Talk to Ari and Purgatory. We'll do her thing after the first half. And get myself a few you. levels at least. I need a cab to the Presidium. It'll be there momentarily. Uh huh. Apparently, my son decides he wants to be loud today too. So it's a good thing he's not in here. some pieces for you. Done deal, Commander. Check in with General Oraka. You'll see I'm making CSEC very happy. Hey, 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 hey. Sorry. It's not quite as easy to snark in this one. Just so dreary. Everything's so sad. <laughs> 
father who's donating high-end weapons to CSAC. He wanted you to know. Sounds like you came through. Yep. The Blue Suns can go about their business. Now we'll be focusing on Citadel defense. It won't bring Palavan back, but it's something. Thank you, Commander. You're welcome. Now it's time to go talk to Arya. Not on Docking Bay 42. Welcome, Commander Shepard. Please select a destination. Purgatory. Blood pack and eclipse are in my pocket. I'll send them to war when you're ready for them. Is there anything on your mind? Mm. What exactly? An army eclipse? Well worth a little. Uh. With Grill, it's his boy. The blood pack have committed 2,000 Vorcha to the cause. They'll make his donor Voss. Getting General Arak. Voss still thinks he'll be getting me on mine. Idiot. <laughs> He's committed his veteran soldiers to me. In turn, I commit them to you. What have we gained by having a ton of mechs? Sane has turned out to be more Malcolm than Jonas Sedaris ever was. <laughs> My control of the Eclipse runs even deeper than I expected. You surprised me by taking such agency in the matter. How do you plan? I, do. I think I'm going to slap Omega right out of the elusive land. We'll talk later. I'm sure. Don't give me that, Arya. You're the one that wants me to help you take it back. Let's see. Anything else on the Citadel that I need to do right now? All of that stuff is off planet. So let's go do Grissom Academy. Get some fighting in this playthrough. Doing a lot of running around doing errands for everybody else. It's time to not shoot things. What am I doing? Let's get in here. Go back to the Normandy. Convenient, that. Let's go check out my war assets. He'll get his people moving in the right direction. He's a good guy with his home world on fire. All he committed to is this war summit. A war summit we have to hope since the Solarians won't even let a coconut work their shit. Let me in. Yay! We are not doing too bad. Ouch. Targeting VIs. Kazumi, why is she only 25? I thought she was 50. Huh. Oh well. 
Yeah, we're doing pretty good so far. We're already almost at minimum effective military strength. We're well past it for the if we did the readiness. And I'm pretty sure it's 4,000 is the points we need, not 14,000 like I said last time. Thank you. Let me throw. Save. Leave orbit. <laughs> Petra Nebula. We are taking with us best Liara and Javik I don't need anything you there's your super beam how much damage We'll stick you on the Valkyrie with the magazine upgrade. now. Just the one. Okay. Four auto. Forty five auto. Lift grenade. <laughs> Confirm. No, I'm not gonna insert disc two. I'm just gonna let you keep going. who answered the distress call. Cerberus Cruiser. At least a dozen fighters on blockade duty. Not too many for us in a straight up fight. They must want this place bad. And I forgot to change my armor. Incoming transmission. Let's hear it. SSB Normandy. This is Kaylee Sanders, director of Grissom Academy. We need immediate assistance. Yep. Cerberus is attacking the facility. They're after my students. This is Commander Shepard. We're blocked on a direct approach. I know. They've taken control of our docking base. Any alternatives? There's an auxiliary cargo port I could probably open. All right. We'll come in by shuttle and get your students out of there. Joker, can you give me a diversion? Sure. Oh, boy, can I? <laughs> You go that way, we'll go this way. Pew pew! Hello! Pew pew! <laughs> Come and get me! Bye 
Bye bye. Meanwhile. Ugh. Ugh. Yeah, I'm awake. I promise. <clears throat> and we're here, so we're gonna save. Super kaboom. Can I come in? Sanders were clear. It's me. A nice shotgun Anderson, you got there. Admiral Anderson always said you were the best. And with Cerberus coming for my students, I need the best. How many of you are there? Fewer than 20. Most were sent home when word of the Reaper invasion spread. But a few volunteered to stay. Some are prototyping tech for the Alliance. Others are biotics. They've been training for military operations, working together as biotic artillery. You said something about Admiral. Yes. We met I was there when Saren. David saved my life that day. He was on Earth when the Reaper had not heard. Mm. Alive and fighting. Good. If we get out of here. A few months not. Agreed. They wanted to help. How could we say no? Hang on. I've been trying to get communications working. This is Frober. There are students trapped in Orion Hall. Cerberus has us boxed in. They're closing fast. Mm-hmm. Oh, Ryan Hall? Back out the door and down the hallway. I can get the door open. I'll bring them back sure. here and we'll make a run for the shuttle. Thank you, Commander. I'll stay put. With luck, I can regain control of some of our systems. Saving again, because this is insanity level. Taking kids. Attention, all students. Cerberus troops have taken control of this station. We have no desire to hurt you. Surrender, and you will not be harmed. Uh huh. And we can't guarantee your safety. No one is going to hurt you. The file says this is your side. But your sister, she's optional. You give us trouble. <laughs> Hello. You're safe now. There may be more nearby. Play dead until it's safe, then get to Kaylee Sanders at security. Okay, but my sister Sean is out here somewhere too. That's what I'm here for. Uh, no. 
I hurt. No, oh, good. Why aren't you using your thank you? Kaboom. Got it, Cerberus. Save. Your brother? Your brother. He's with Kaylee Sanders at security. Can you get to her? Yeah. I just need to rest for a minute. Thank you. Uh huh. Alliance propaganda. We're the only ones who can save you. Yes. I. How about you guys prove it? No platitudes. Commander, I just got an emergency message from the students in Orion Hall. One of our instructors is with them, but they can't hold out much longer. And it's time to fight. <laughs> Hi, Jack. Jack. You sure grew a lot of hair in six months. Shepherd. Oh, great. Look, I've got a weapon that I didn't have before. Come on. Oh boy. What is hitting me? Nothing. Where did he go?
How about you get up? Just keep throwing your... Boom. I didn't. You're not telling me anything I haven't told myself, Jack. I didn't oh, trust bad. them. Well, shit. I bet that's <laughs> a big comfort to all the people Cerberus has killed. I'd forgotten how angry she was. <laughs> Whereas I barely remember you at all, Blue. Your real first name is Jennifer. I can find your last name if you ask politely. Okay. Right now, all I care about is getting my guys out of here. Your guys? Yeah. The kids. Yeah. I guess so. I can't think of anybody who could care about them more. Well, I had some free time while you were off playing hero. I can tell. Lions you grew your hair. I helped you. <laughs> they offered me this. And apparently the students responded well to my teaching style. The psychotic biotic. I will destroy you! <laughs> Drink your juice, Rodriguez. We couldn't destroy wet tissue paper. Cortez to extraction team. The Cerberus cruiser is coming back. How long have we got? Two minutes tops, Commander. After that, there's no way we'll get past them. Yeah. Get out of here and back to the Normandy. We'll find another way off the station. Roger that. Good luck, ma'am. Shepard to Sanders. The students are safe, but the shuttle's a no-go. Understood. I might know another way off the station, but I need station-wide camera access. Can you disable the Cerberus security override? It's routed through Orion Hall, so it should be nearby. How does camera access get us off this station? We need to reach the Cerberus shuttles. The cruiser won't auto-target friendly ships, which gives us a fighting chance to escape. Get me back to camp. Sanders, you should have access now. Got it. The fastest way is through the atrium, but Cerberus has sealed the doors. You'll need to disable the magnetic locks. The overrides should be directly above the door. As many credits and experience and stuff as I can. So our teacher worked with Commander Shepard? That's pretty badass. Yeah. I can't believe you and our teacher work together. We'll be ready when you need us, Commander. Maybe we've got a chance. How's your hand? Got it. Level up! out throw or bump up singularity let's bump up singularity more damage per second or recharge speed it's actually really fast recharge speed so let's actually do some better damage and you you there open now i'll get to the shuttles ahead of you and get a pair ready to fly works for me talk hey let me know when we've got a new way off this station 
education. Are the students? How do you tell it to you? You don't think? I don't think they have a choice. You have to say it. I never. Anyone screws with my students. What's the <laughs> well, well, It's like a biotic. Stay close. Good. Let's do this. Thanks for your help, both Everyone of you. Everyone be ready. We'll go in first and draw their fire. We'll shadow you from the second level and hit those fu- Uh, the, those guys. A useful tactic. They would avoid direct fire. Just time your shots and stay safe. Yeah. All right. I didn't bust my ass training you so you could die now. Keep low, pick your targets. Students of Grissom Academy, the station is sealed. The Alliance soldiers cannot save you. They don't All need they to. All they can do is get you killed. Surrender peacefully and you won't be harmed. <sighs> Asshole. Damn it, they're messaging <laughs> everyone. Students, switch your Omni tools to privacy mode so they can't track you. What if... What if they're not lying? Are they guys? You've already held your own against Cerberus. You've been trained for this by one of the best. Come on, Rodriguez. They're only asking nicely because you scared them in that last fight. So take <laughs> your balls out of your purse and kick, and kick some, some ass. ass. <laughs> yes, ma'am. Let's go. This is why we love Jack. And I forgot to save before the door, but that's okay. Standing still anyway, so I might as well just keep doing this. Oh! Ow. Come on. Take him out. Boom. I get up so we can kill him like that. Kill any engineer you see. I will 
Ravens. Thank you. That's more like it. Oh boy. Oh, come on. I was far enough away. Oh, good. It saved me. Boom. Keep it in your eyes. <laughs> Chavik. Oh, not so fast this time, huh? Smoking. Good sign. <laughs> Javik. Just want to kill this Atlas and then I'll. <laughs> Die already. Thank you. Oh, great. You got a turret out. It's okay. I'll deal with this atlas first. Look 
looks like it's almost dead. Definitely smoking a lot now. Bigger explosion. Boom. We can do this. We got this. Oh, boom. Put that over there. In case another one comes by. Ooh, too low. Of course there's one. them dance around in pain. They all killed him. Alright, where'd the Atlas go? The Atlas is destroyed. Did they seriously do it? Oop! Oop! No! No! <laughs> That's what I get for forgetting about a turret. Now we have to do that all over again. Oh, that was the dumbest thing I've done in a while. better idea on what I need to do. <coughs> Just sit back and let him come to me. Can he take a grenade? And I can't at full shields and full health. Well, I suppose the answer to that is because he's Javik. Now. Of course, Commander. 
going the warp and again and again and again and again and again and again <laughs> And it's dead. Come on. Stupid smoke grenades, I hate them. Shields recharging. Hello, turret. <laughs> That's going on the highlight reel. Yes, 
Okay, into a hallway that I have a better chance of guarding in. on the other side of the door. How did that... Ah. Thank you for the credits. Why can't I save it yet? Stop it with your super NBA throws. Oh, 
Kaboom. <coughs> Come on, door. <laughs> and this is why not being able to do Overlord is very sad. Because he'd be right there. I'm Commander Shepard with the Alliance. I'm here to help. I didn't buy it from the last guy and I've got no reason to buy it now. This is a multi-core shield prototype based on cyclonic barrier tech. It'll hold up your guns for hours. Sanders, okay, Lee. Shepherd, I've got some scary <laughs> students hiding behind a shield prototype. How do we know it isn't just Cerberus rigging the voice? You could test for distortion peaks, Isaac. Like I did when you faked a voice print to break curfew. <laughs> and if that's Octavia's shield, remind her that I docked her half a grade because application of non-concurrent forces overloaded the emitters. Thanks, Sanders. Yeah. You great job keeping yourself safe. The biotic students are up there. Stay close. I'll get you out of here. Okay. Uh, thanks. Thanks, I guess. <laughs> yes, take your shield with you. Save again. I think we're coming up onto piling the, piloting the Atlas mech, which I'm going to try and continue the no shots fired in, which is going to be quite interesting if i say the least looks like schematics for amp interfaces not as good as what we already have but still worth a look sarah's council yes, Kaboom. Took a while to kill that guy. <laughs> Confused him as to why I was using biotics and not. Here we go.
I can't save it. Hi, boys. Hello. Chair. Hello. <laughs> Squish. Why isn't he firing the guns? Running around. Squish. Dang it. They got them before I could. Come on. Go forward. Only that squished him. That did. Fun. Come on, go through the chairs.
suppose I could be meleeing. Fun. Be nice if I had one of those, wouldn't it? <laughs> Why am I no longer locking on? It was before that smoke even went up. Focus on me. Pretty sure I picked up everything. Once again, with the Avenger that I don't actually have equipped. Take the controls and get the students aboard. Wait, where the hell's Rodriguez? Oh boy. She needs covering fire. She needs more than that. Dog. 
Get in here. station if you hadn't come yeah well forget that we kicked some ass next place we dock you're all getting inked my treat <laughs> what do you guys want ascension project logo glowing fist maybe a unicorn for rodriguez <laughs> screw you ma'am i can't believe we got them out alive i was going to suggest that they stick to support roles but perhaps they're ready after all Mm, this is a little better. Ready, but the alliance needs them in a support role. What? We trained for artillery strikes. We don't need another artillery unit. We need stronger barriers for our frontline squads. This is bullshit. Hey, if that's where they need us, that's where we go. Besides, I'm sure we'll get some shots in. Uh, yeah. <laughs> support doesn't mean you're not doing anything. <laughs> what the heck is that? <laughs> Jack promised to watch your language in order to maintain the necessary professionalism we need from our teachers. Necessary professionalism. I bet if we empty that thing, we can afford another cruiser. Cover your ears, kids. Hey, Joker. <laughs> and this is why we love Jack. Sight for sore eyes. Good to see you too, sir. Sir, I may have reinstated you, but that doesn't give you permission to go all formal on me. Yeah, well. I'm glad you managed to keep your ass alive, Anderson. That's more like it. <laughs> Looks like you didn't waste any time getting to work. I can only imagine what would have happened to those people if you fallen into Cerberus' hands. They're definitely eager to help. These students are some of the best humanity has to offer, and we're throwing them into battle. God damn it, I hate this war. Hackett didn't mention in his report. Kaylee Sanders is safe. She's with the recruits. Thanks, Shepard. When I heard about the attack, well, I've already lost a lot of friends. Yeah. She asked me to tell you to stay alive. <laughs> <laughs> Did she now? Well, thanks, Shepard. That might be the first good news I've heard this week. Anderson out. I could on VidCom. Actually, not really. No, it was the, the running gag. Every time I finish talking, I'll turn around. Oh, Anderson's on VidCom. Uh, back in. <laughs> Yay! 1413 and 706 effective. Static students, blah, blah, blah. Kaylee gets you 20 points. Oh, there's more. Of course, Jack gets you 25. I could have sworn that your crewmates give you 50. Might just be certain ones. I don't know. Having trouble getting the orange out of the bag. See the feed from Palavin? It's brutal. And the bees in the trees are annoying. The birds don't quit when things get ugly. I'll give them that. Commander, you have an encrypted message from a Miranda Lawson. <laughs> Forwarded from Kaylee.
So Jack's an instructor? I guess anyone who messes with biotic kids gets turned into a small stain on the floor and ceiling. Ooh, and that was Cerberus attacking the Academy. Man, that must have been like Christmas for her. <laughs> Boy, nice job on getting them out of there. Yeah, Throwing she... Out some impressive biotic power. Good. We could use some heavy hitters in the biotics department. It'll be good for them, too. Biotics face a lot of discrimination. Maybe if they save the galaxy, people will get over their issues. I didn't expect you to be sensitive about that. Hey, I'm just tired of them stealing the spotlight from people with actual disabilities. <laughs> I break ribs if I sneeze too hard. Being able to move crap with your mind is not a handicap. <laughs> Yeah, but yeah, she totally redecorated for Christmas. There's red everywhere. Just a few more things here, and I think I'll call it good. Go have some dinner. Commander, I was exploring your ship. I noticed. Find anything interesting? This space has absorbed much anger. The biotic instructor from the academy. Yep. Right. These were Jack's quarters. Traces of her pain are still present. I'm told she sought revenge against Cerberus when she was here. A goal you helped fulfill. Mm -hmm. I hope you will do the same for me. At least I have better quarters. Hey, she wanted these. I tried to get this with the whole house. Like, seven times. Uh, at least. Oh, I knew this was coming. I just mean <coughs> it's an amazing work of engineering. Elastic titanium silicon polymers, ultra light harmonic phase power Yeah, cells. you were looking at her power cells. Mm -hmm. And if she ever accidentally walks into a wall, there's just so much padding. Oh, I knew it. Yep. You pretty much are, Kenneth. <laughs> Welcome aboard, Chief. Nothing to report. Need anything, Commander? How's Engineer Donnelly working out? The kid's got talent. Now if he could just learn to shut his damn mouth. <laughs> Problems? I'm sorry, Commander. Donnelly is dedicated, knowledgeable, and thinks on his feet. I'm glad to have him on my team. They're talking Could about me. a lesson or two about respecting chain of command, but I've handled the likes of him before. No need for concern. How's Engineer Daniels working out? Her, I like. She's sharp and <laughs> knows propulsion theory better than most physicists I've met. And she's easy to work with, too. Always said you had an eye for talent. Good job bringing her back to the Alliance. Carry on, Adams. Aye, aye, ma'am. You guys up for another game of Quasar? Anybody? <coughs> Anybody? Come on, I need another 500 credits. I'm glad the commander didn't forget her. Her here. I told you Shepard would come visit. <coughs> yeah, I'm the one that pardoned you. Whiner. <laughs> That one's full, except for that one down in the middle here. <coughs> Got the Citadel. Which, for anybody that didn't know, if you watch the Citadel, it does spin. And close. And open again. 
pretty cool. Uh, didn't get any new squad, but we're good there. Already got the emails. I have fish! Thank you, VI. Thank you, my fish alive. Armor set. N7 Defender is ammo and weapon. Cerberus armor is weapon. Looks cool, though. Terminus armor, ammo capacity and melee damage. Massive shield boost, health boost goes down. But it's the Terminus. Oh, I miss it. <laughs> Blood dragon armor. Power damage and power recharge go up. Health goes way down. Shield boost goes up. Melee damage goes down. Shield regen goes down. I may try this out for a while, just simply because I'm biotic. Let's see, which ones did I get? Armax doesn't help me. Ariaki, Hanikadar, weapon damage. Our weapon damage. Ooh, there we go. Get some power damage. I'm waiting for that one. Oh yeah. Power damage, power recharge. Health is still up. Shield regen goes down though. But I'll take it. What, do I have the hoodie on under here? Is that why that's got the stripe? <laughs> now I'll stick with the Ariaki for now. Awesome! We'll try this out next mission. If that doesn't work out very well, we'll go to the Blood Dragon. Save it. Why didn't I check my other stuff first? Three points, and I'm almost at level 40. Citadel, 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 Eden Prime. And Priority Sir Cash. Much of these as I can. Most of them I can't do until more spaces, places open up. But yeah. Let's just see what's out here. See if anything new has opened up yet. No, nope, doesn't look like it. All right. Well, that was a good run. Did a whole bunch of running around and doing things for people. And then we went and saved Jack because we're awesome. <laughs> I think it's been a good run. Don't you? <laughs> My poor wifey. <coughs> Case in point. <laughs> Anyway, yeah, this has been a lot of fun. I will definitely be back at the earliest Monday, more than likely Tuesday, for the regularly scheduled stuffs. We'll see. Well, we're, we're coming along pretty well in the Mass Effect 3 
We may or may not have to do the multiplayer. Like I said, it all depends on how close I can get to that 4,000 points. And I'll do some research into that just to make sure that's the point value I need for this super special awesome secret ending, which isn't really secret anymore because, uh, let's face it, this game's six years old. <laughs> so, but anyway, yeah, this has been Matt from Ascension Props with another stunning rendition of the Mass Effect trilogy. No shots fired, technically, playthrough. It's been a lot of fun, and I'm really enjoying it. And it's going to kind of be sad when it's all done. I may have to do a full run through again with my soldier just so I can feel like I can shoot things again. <laughs> We'll see. Anyway, if you don't follow me here already, click the follow button and you'll be notified whenever I go live. If you're watching this on YouTube, click that subscribe button so you can be updated when that goes live. And follow me on Facebook, Twitter, ascensionprops.com. I've told you all of those before. You should know those by heart by now, but I'll say them again. Facebook.com slash ascensionprops. Ascensionprops.com, I already said, but uh, Twitch, Instagram, Tumblr, those are all the same username as here on Twitch. And if you're on YouTube, all the links will be down below. So, once again, another quick run. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.